Now I'm the one that you call when it's time to ball I'm with my West Coast, is this a three-peat y'all? Came on lock from the top of the key Merce Quick and J-Rock, it's hot, we hit for three We here, meant to be, no fear for enemies You feel the energy, we near infinity We timeless, rhymes just find us to speak through About to put the full court press on your weak crew You can't defend, you fake, you so pretend It's up and going in, now watch me go for ten Star in my own right, you better play your zone tight Cause when I'm in my zone, you know I'm going all night Shoot the lights out, mustard out the hot dog Who else supposed to eat the game up? Cause it's not y'all, legend like Chick Hearn When will these kids learn? You touch an NBA live wire and get burned Every time you see a Sherry Living life perfect, now we flawless Flawless, y'all in trouble Cause we have up on the hustle Every time you see a Sherry Living life perfect, now we flawless Flawless, y'all in trouble Cause we have up on the hustle it's J-Rock, you can't stop the dribble Man, I'm need is love how I penetrate the middle I maneuver cross country now, I'm nice Young scrub like bub, I'll shoot out your lights Used to ride rugged, now I ride plush You ride the bench, I ride GTs and up White tees, sometimes my three-piece to tucks I'm cool like five ice cubes in my cup Balling out of control, like an offensive You ride the hole, you should know my style Get on the While winning on the road is so important, especially as you get down to the stretch run of the season, because now you start thinking about playoff games, and to become a champion, you really have to win on the road. And it's an eight-second violation. How did that happen, Steve? Did he lose sight of the clock? I think so, and there was a little defensive pressure in the backcourt, more that took a few seconds off the clock, and then a lack of concentration cost him the turnover. Two and a half minutes remaining in the first quarter. The score is tied. Jones trying to stay in front of him. Nice entry pass and scores. That's great defense, Mar, but that's too good. Nice touch around the hoop. And an eight-second violation is called. And the field goal. Really important, Mar, for a shooter early in ballgames to get a couple of shots in areas where he's comfortable from. That establishes his rhythm. That gets him going for the rest of the game. He hit it. Well, as a coach, I mean, that's what you want. You want to get players in areas where they're comfortable and... Well, guys that talented and that good, they're going to make a high percentage of those shots. Yes! Great job offensively, Marv, running the lanes and finding the open man in transition. And that's a big basket here in the early going. And Steve Nash not able to hit from downtown. He can make that one in his sleep, Marvin. I mean, that, that's his comfort zone, and I don't care what you do defensively. If he gets in that spot, he's going to make that nine times out of ten. A minute remaining in the quarter. Timberwolves up by three. Nash with the shot and gets the friendly roll. That was a three-point attempt, and able to knock it down. That's a 10-2 run for the Timberwolves. This is the last thing this home crowd wanted to see, Marv. They came in here fired up, ready to cheer, and they've got nothing to be excited about. Half minute left in the first. Timberwolves up by two.
Nice pass. Three seconds remaining. The first quarter is in the books. The Wolves lead by two. Wow, look at that assist to field goal ratio. That's exactly what coaches want to see. So both clubs have played solid basketball. No, you're right, Marv. The offensive execution has been terrific. Both teams getting out in transition. They're moving the ball. They're really setting solid screens. And we're seeing a lot of wide open looks out here. Pretty entertaining first quarter. Marv, it's important for this club not to panic right now. Yes, they've given up the lead, but this is a long game. If they continue to play hard, they're going to be fine. Jefferson pulls it up. Oh, what a pass. Hill fires. Great defensive possession there, Marv. Everybody challenging their man. Open shot and scores and gets the friendly roll and the field goal Look out, good play. Petrov firing. That's a 10 to 2 run for the Timberwolves. Well, things are getting a little out of hand, Marv. I think this club needs a timeout because if they're not careful, they're going to get blown right out of here. For three, yes. Here come the Suns. Jefferson on the rebound. The Wolves will get it back. I don't know how this club expects to get back into the game if they continue to throw the ball around and not value each possession. They need solid execution if they're going to get back into it. Yes. Down to a half minute remaining in the half. Timberwolves up by 13. Nash draws the double. Down to 20 seconds remaining in the quarter. Timberwolves up by 13. Nash coming over with some help defense. Open opportunity. Jefferson ends up with it. Well, at the half, the T-Wolves lead by 13. The Timberwolves are in command, Steve, but what do they have to do in the second half to maintain this style of play? Well, they've got to continue to play with intensity, Marv. You know, in the NBA, it's a 48-minute game. With that 24-second shot clock, things can change in a hurry. So if they're not careful, they could give up this lead very easily. Here come the Suns. Phoenix cannot find an opening. Here's the double. Nice pass inside. That will count. And the foul. Beautiful entry pass thrown by Richardson. Beautiful move there, Marv. He's able to complete the play even while he's fouled. And he makes it.
and scores. Petrov able to reach for it. Mark, they did a terrific job getting the ball in the paint. He just didn't make the basket. And the field goal. That's an 11-3 run for the Timberwolves. This is a very important time in this game, Marv. The lead getting a little out of hand. They might want to get a timeout to try to stop the bleeding here. And the bucket. Very difficult attempt there, Marv, but he gets the ball to go in. Yes. Nash pushes it up. Open opportunity. And Jason Richardson showing his range. He fires from downtown. Richardson rebounds. It's a three on two. Here come the T-Wolves. And scores. Marv, you know the old coach's adage, great offense starts with solid defense. That's certainly the case here. Pass intercepted. And the field goal. But when you're down big, Marv, it's important to just go ahead and quit, hand the ball to the other team and say, all right, if you want to score again, that's fine with me. Nice play. Yes. Yes. That was a three-point attempt. Brewer able to hustle it down. So after three, the T-Wolves lead by 17. We move on to the fourth quarter, and what a disastrous effort this has been. And we've heard it from the crowd all night long. Well, they don't have a whole lot to cheer about, Marv, because their team has really been lacking as far as effort is concerned. And I don't know, I, I think in order to win this game, they're going to have to start doing some things they haven't done all game. Take charges, get on the floor for loose balls, at least show some effort. And the bucket! Two and a half minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. Timberwolves up by 17. The alley-oop pass, right on target. Well, if you want to win in the NBA, Marv, you've got to defend. I haven't seen any defense tonight from this club. Yes. Finally, an easy basket, Marv, but it's a case of way too little, far too late. This game completely out of hand. And scores. Phoenix gets it across. And Jason Richardson will put it home. And the field goal. Nash looking to make his move. A minute and a half remaining in the fourth. Timberwolves up by 17. Yes.
Open shot and scores. And he gets the friendly roll. Here's Nash. And Steve Nash for three. Richardson on the rebound. For three, he hit it. Six second differential between the game clock and the shot clock. And gets the friendly rim. Now here's the double. And the field goal. The Suns will get it back. There's the horn, and that's the game. The Wolves have won it. The final score is 55-42. to 42. This is Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr saying so long from the U.S. Airways Center in Phoenix.